Hey guys, how's it going? DUJ2 here, and welcome back to Puzzle Monster Quest. Now, um, there's two things I want to talk about in this video. The first thing I want to talk about is, check out, I got a ring. <laughs> I just had to show it off because it's so cool. Uh, I'm still trying to get that ultimate twin form, but I did get a ring, so that's pretty cool. And what I want to talk about right now is Bobos. Um, Bobos and keys. So what I'm going to do right now is first of all, I'm going to collect. Can I collect my Yeeg? I don't think I can collect my thing. Yeah, I can. Cool. All right. So I'm going to collect this. Wow, it's been three hours. I've been working. That's crazy. Um, so I'm going to collect that. Uh, I'm going to go back here to village. Uh, I'm see so right now we have the bobos and you guys I've already done a video about the bobos explaining how bobos work explaining how you do it, but What happens when you Don't get the bobo you want or the bobo carnival you need for example Today in a few hours actually we will be having uh, another zodiac god event So if I go to the news here uh, Chinese beast there they are so, uh, today is the 25th, so at 1 p.m., 2 p.m. my time, it's going to be here. Only for two hours. And if I go to my monsters right now and I look at my formations, I look at my, ma uh, my I want to say magic, but it's my water or ice, my blue, my blue set. These guys down here are not all the way maxed out, and I want them maxed out. So what can you do? What you do is you use keys. So that's what we're going to do right now. So you go over here, you go to single player, you go to event. And in the event, you go all the way down and see the keys down here. See how it works? Okay, so this is the thing. You can only use these a certain amount of times. For example, you only get five tries a day. I've already used four keys right now. I bought a bunch of keys lately and I've been trying some stuff. Um, so we go to Boba Carnival. And see how it says here keys used you have not used the key yet that's very important so you can go ahead and you can go ahead and press any of these and you haven't used the key yet um, and again you can get you can get evolving stuff from the scaling dungeon you can get books you can get wiggles you can get Titans you can get um, aliens or you can go to the Bobo carnival one so today the Bobo carnival we have is going to be red uh, again, I need blue. So because I don't want to wait, because I want to go in with possibly the best, the absolute best way that I can with my setup, what I need to do is I need to go down to events. I need to go all the way down to the Bobo. Oopsie, they see that's the wrong one. To the Bobo Carnival. I need to find the Carnival Gurgling Waltz, which is the one that I want to use. See, so you can just hit detail to see which one it was. I want the blue one. Also, something I've noticed, you get a lot more five stars from this one. I'm going to go in, into it. Again, I haven't, I still haven't used the key yet. So I'm going to go find, it's Corum. All right. Whoa, that is amazing. Look at this, Muriel. Deal water damage to 50% of your total HP damage. Wow. I need to evolve her. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to use this, guys. Um, and okay, so now look. See down here? See where it says stamina? I'm going to use up one stamina. Not 30, but I will consume a key. So that's how it works. You use a key, and we're going to tap it right now. And it's going to ask you again if you want to use a key. Are you sure you want to use a key? I mean, they like really, really want to make sure you want the key. And I use a key, and I'm in. Okay, so that's that's how the the carnivals work. That's the, sorry, that's how the magical keys work. So you might be wondering, okay, I have all these magical keys. What should I do with them? You can actually use them on bobos. You can use them on evolve without having to wait the exact day. Yes, you can also buy keys, um, but you do have a limited amount of keys you can use per day. And uh oh, I messed up. I should have come in with my um, with my all luck team. Oh man. Well, this is fine, but I really should have come in here with my all luck team. Uh, I didn't need to. Well, I don't know why I came in with my blue team. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. I should have come in with my luck team, and I should have come in with my lightning team, uh, because, well, I obviously was not thinking here, guys. Okay. Um, hopefully, though, I don't know if luck matters in these. To be honest. You know what? To be perfectly honest, I do not know if luck matters in these. Because 
I've been running it with my 98 luck team and I've been getting three to five five star bobos every single time. Um, maybe luck has something to do with it? I don't know. This is an interesting test. I'll have to do, I'll have to do two uh, soon. Uh, maybe tomorrow if we don't get a blue bobo carnival or whatever, whichever one we get tomorrow. Um, I might do a couple of tests. I might do one with a team that doesn't have, with like my strongest monsters. And I'll do one with a high luck team and see what we get. But here so far, we've already gotten three eggs. Um, let's see. Bum, bum, bum. Oh, muffins. Let's go this way. Yeah, I'm not hitting them very hard either. Mm -hmm. Well, that was another chest right there. Um, let's go this way. Because I'm going to be pulling out my guys. All right, and also another thing to take to take uh, to check out. Oh, wow, another one. So two eggs. Uh, another thing to really look at when you're doing the the bobos is to remember that um, you don't exactly need the ones who will hit the hardest. You actually need the ones who will hit more times. Because see how I'm just hitting one on that target on that bobo. Um, you don't hit. You don't like um, on the little guys. You can't. The little guys. It feels like the first hit never hits. Um, but the subsequent hits do hit damage and it doesn't happen like that with the big ones. The big bobos, you have to, um, you have to just hit them like 10 times, I think, which is why it's really important to build a chain. See, like here, Mikasa will, okay, see everyone there jumped out and hit, so that, <coughs> <coughs> that was very effective. Ow, I'm getting hit a lot. Specials will work though, specials will work on them, I have noticed that. Uh, we're at four or five. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use a special here. Um, who can I use? Decrease all HP for three turns. Increase or store all HP. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna use you to take all of these guys down. Wow, that is awesome. That is very cool. That is a very cool skill. I need to work on her. <laughs> She's pretty awesome. I kind of would. Okay, now I kind of wish I had to come in. I had come in with my all uh, special. Oh, my, my high luck team, because I, I will say, honestly, I have, I did see a large increase in drops and eggs. I was getting almost 10 eggs every single time that I did with my, with my luck team. Oh, wow. It didn't even damage you. Will Mikasa do anything to you? Yeah, Mikasa will. Okay, cool. And, okay, dropped an egg too. So that's pretty good for a, a relatively low luck team that I'm running right now. Um, this was actually not bad at all. Let's take a look at it now. And again, you're not using stamina. You're just using the keys. Yes, the keys take a long time to get. And yes, the keys also are expensive if you look at it from the crystal point of view. Cool. So I, I got four guys. I got four five-star blue bobos in that time. 75,000 experience each one. That's pretty good, guys. That's pretty good. I just got 300,000 experience right there. All right. Okay, so I have no tries available because I've already used up my five keys for the day, so it won't let me do it again. Um, and then if we go down here, we're going to go... Today, also, we have double fuse time, so I'm actually going to start with... You know what? We're just going to we're just gonna work on Gabriel first. So we're going to work on Gabriel first and fuse him. Hopefully, we, hopefully good luck, good luck, good luck, good luck. Come on, give me a good fuse, good fuse, good fuse, good fuse, good fuse. Ah, oh, regular one. Unfortunate. Okay. Um... He's at level 80 though. How much? How many blues do I have? Oh, okay. I don't have that many. Um, let me you. Let me do him now. All right. Hopefully we get a good fuse here. Come on, a regular fuse. Wow. <laughs> I was getting really supers and ultras the other day, guys. Man, or last or this morning, I guess before I did this. Um, Mikasa. Okay, Mikasa's gonna have to take the rest. Hopefully she gets a good one. Come on. Oh my goodness. There's double luck right now. There's double chance, and this is how bad my RNG is. All right, that's fine. Um, let's go down and see the other ones. I think I have a couple of other blue ones. Okay, so apparently this is it. This is where we end here. Um, this did help a little bit because I was able to get my guys a little stronger. That's a super success. It's not an ideal one, but it's okay. So, um, 
there we go that is my full team now um, I really can't do anything else for this team apart from and I may actually you do this use red bobos the the dan the kind of the dancer that is active right now I might use some of those to finish getting these guys a little stronger anyway there you go guys uh, that is basically a guide on how to use the keys now something else that we will talk about in the future because I'm gonna do another video soon where I actually go into the scaling dungeon and I do all of them because there are secret bosses when you use keys this is what we fig we figured out so far we don't know exactly we don't know exactly how it works yet but we have figured out so far that there are certain in the scaling dungeons there are certain dungeons that will give you the chance of a secret boss and these secret bosses are really cool like squiggly characters holding a big key and those monsters are necessary to be able to evolve to seven stars or and six stars some other monsters specifically monsters you can get from story quest so to be able to make your monsters even stronger there are ways to do it without technically spending any money so there you go guys that's all I have for you today. Thank you very much for watching, guys. I am DUJ2. This has been Puzzle Monster Quest, a introduction guide, whatever you want to call it. And let me show you guys. This is this is the team I should have been using. This is my luck team. I shouldn't be. I should have been using this one. Uh, so this is my. Oh, you know what? And I need to. I need to go with daggers too. Again, in these, what's important is multiple hits not how hard you're hitting so going in with daggers and these is a great idea because daggers you can hit really well all around so there you go guys thank you very much for watching i am duj2 and i'll see you guys next time see ya